This family tree maps out the ancestry of Archibald Archer Thweet and Fanny LaRue Moore. Archibald's father was Francis Fitzgerald Thweet. Francis's father was also named Archibald. That Archibald Thweet, born in 1810, had Father Thomas Thweet, born in 1782. And Thomas Thweet was the son of John Thweet. John had another son by the name of Archibald, who was born in 1769. And that Archibald married Lucy Epps. Archibald, this Archibald is the great, great uncle of the Archibald Tweed who was married to Fanny LaRue Moore, where we started. But this Archibald's marriage to Lucy Epps provides several connections to Thomas Jefferson and his family. If we look at Lucy's parents, we see that Lucy had a brother, John Wales Epps. And John Wales Epps married Maria Jefferson, the daughter of Thomas and Martha Jefferson. So that's one connection. Thomas and Martha's daughter, Maria, married John Wales Epps, who was the brother of Lucy Epps, married to this Archibald Thweet. Let's go back to where we started. A quick way to get from here back to Lucy Epps is to use these little symbols called, uh, they're symbols for a tree for the individual people. So for Archibald Archer's tree, we would click that symbol and that maps out his own ancestry. His father, Francis Fitzgerald, Grandfather Archibald, great-grandfather Thomas Thweet, great-great-grandfather John Thweet, and John Thweet, we don't have any record further back than that, but if we click here now, we get back to John Thweet's family card showing his two sons, Thomas and Archibald, and remember, remember Archibald is the one that married Lucy Epps. So, looking at Lucy Epps a bit further, let's look at her own tree. We see that Lucy had Father Francis Epps, Grandfather Richard Epps, and Great-Grandfather Colonel Francis Epps IV. Hang on to that information. Lucy Epps had as a grandfather, I'm sorry, great-grandfather, Colonel Francis Epps IV. If we go back to Maria Jefferson and look at her family tree, we see the same character. Maria's mother was Martha Wales, wife of Thomas Jefferson. Martha's, Martha Wales' mother was Martha Epps, so that's how we see that Maria Jefferson came also from an Epps line, and in fact, Martha Epps's father was Colonel Francis Epps IV. So for Maria Jefferson, we also have mother, grandmother, great-grandfather, Colonel Francis Epps. So the bottom line on that is that Maria Jefferson and Lucy Epps have a common great-grandfather in Colonel Francis Epps IV. And that means they are second cousins in virtue of that common great-grandfather. Let's go back to Lucy and see one other connection.
Lucy's mother was Elizabeth Wales. And Elizabeth Wales' father is John Wales. So file that away. Lucy Epps has as a grandfather John Wales, born 1715. This was via his marriage to Mary Tabitha Cock. If we look at John Wales more closely, he did have a wife, Mary Tabitha Cock, but that was actually his second wife. If we look at his family from his first wife, his first wife was Martha Epps, and Martha Epps was the mother of Martha Wales, who was the wife of Thomas Jefferson. So when we look at the marriage of John Wales to, see, to Martha Epps, his first wife, we see that that marriage produced a granddaughter for him, Maria Jefferson. So to summarize, Maria Jefferson is the granddaughter of John Wales via his first marriage, and Lucy Epps was the granddaughter of John Wales via his second marriage to Tabitha Cock. The bottom line being Maria Jefferson and Lucy Epps have John Wales as a common grandfather, and that makes them first cousins. But there's more here as well. Martha Wales herself is the daughter of John Wales by his first marriage to Martha Epps. If we instead look at his second marriage, Elizabeth Wales is his daughter via his second marriage to Mary Tabitha Cock. So since Elizabeth Wales and Martha Jefferson have both have John Wales as their father, that makes them half sisters. So with Elizabeth Wales being Lucy Epps' mother, that makes her Archibald Thweet's mother-in-law. And we just observed that she is the brother-in-law of Thomas Jefferson, mother-in-law of Archibald Thweet, brother-in-law of Thomas Jefferson. Let's go back and take yet another look at John Wales. His first wife was Martha Epps. Out of that marriage, we get Martha Wales, the wife of Thomas Jefferson. From his second marriage, we get Elizabeth Wales, who is the mother of Lucy Epps. His third marriage produced no children. That was to Elizabeth Lomax. But then he had a fourth relationship with Elizabeth Betty Hemings, his slave. And from that relationship, Sally Hemings was born. So daughter has, uh, John Wales has Martha Wales' daughter from marriage one, Elizabeth Wales has daughter from marriage two, and Sally Hemings has daughter from his relationship with Betty Hemings. So all three of those women are half-sisters. So the conclusion from that then is that the relationship we had previously described between Martha Wales, the wife of Thomas Jefferson, and Elizabeth Wales, the mother of Lucy Epps, 
It also applies to, Halle, to Sally Hemings. All three of them are half-sisters. So coming back to Elizabeth Wales, mother of Lucy Epps, Sally Hemings is Elizabeth's half-sister, which makes Sally Hemings an aunt of Lucy Epps, who married Archibald Thweet, great-great-uncle of the Archibald Thweet who was married to Fanny LaRue Moore. 